good morning students today we start the common salt in chemistry daily life the common salt what we are using in the cooking there are different salts are there that we are going to study in this lesson one is sodium chloride and then baking soda then washing soda okay so these are the salts we study now the common salt so how to prepare the common salt so common salt if you see sea water has 30 to 35 g of dissolved salts per liter of water per liter of, of water we get 30 to 35 g of salt dissolved salt means which is uh, dissolved okay which is sol soluble in the water okay so which is not soluble is called as a dissolved okay so the primary salt present is sodium chloride nacl the common salt we use for the cooking which is also known as a common salt sodium chloride is also another name is what common salt if they ask write the uses of the common salt we should write about the sodium chloride okay so here how to produce the how to prepare the salt salt production Sea water is collected in shallow ditches near the seashore and left for evaporation. How the salt is prepared means near the seashore. That means on the banks of the sea, near the sea, they prepare like a small ponds, small small pits. They make small small gadda na shallow. Shallow ditches means small small uh, ponds. They make which is not the deep. They separate, take some of the sea water. They separate it. and then when the sea when the water is evaporated in the heat so because of the sun heat water will be evaporated after the evaporation the salt will be left behind okay once the sea water evaporates evaporate means bhap as yes? so it leaves behind the raw salt okay so what it will do it leaves behind the raw salt which contains many other salts and a small quantity of sand along with common salt since the salt we are getting from the sea water so salt also mixed with the sand and some other salts this raw salt is purified and crystallized for use so the salt is purified here we get like powder salt na no? but the pure salt we get from the sea is the like stone salt salt has the shape it is called as a crystal for example sugar sugar for each sugar when we separate and say sugar has a shape so sugar also we call it as a crystal crystal shape as a cube shape okay crystallized for use obtaining salt from sea water is difficult and ta and the task has to be carried out task that work has to be carried out very carefully during the purif purification process of raw salt some desired and necessary substances are also added it for example iodine iodine is added in the form of a potassium iodide can you tell why iodine is added to common salt okay so for the common salt when the purifying during the purification purifying means cleaning during the cleaning of the common salt they add the iodine in the form of a potassium iodide is added why we should add the iodine to the common salt find out a few regions of the world few regions means what place in some places of the world have salt mines mines means like factories where the salt is cleaned that gives us a rock salt it believed that some parts of seas or oceans must have dried up long ago and resulted in the salt mines okay mines like we have the coal mines where they separate the coal they break the coal and make into pieces and they uh, those places are called as a mines where they get the coal the virgin place so like that only salt mines means in some places long ago so many thousand years back seas and oceans are dried up so dried means what all the water is evaporated and the salt is left behind and the salt became like a mountains like that na salt mines so that salt is so common salt is an essential component of our diet but can we use sea water to cook food okay salt is present in the sea water can we take the sea water to cook 
can we take the sea water to use in the sabji no salt plays an important role in several biological processes okay why don't we use the sea water why we have to separate the salt in the shop they can sell the sea water na instead of salt no why because in the sea water there are so many impurities are there like sand and some other salts are there so after separating the salt through the evaporation so they it will be purified and added the iodine and therefore so uh, salt is very important for the biological bio means life biological process means life processes inside of our body so many works are taking place so for all this salt is very important our food should have the light quant right quantity of salt in it we should keep a enough salt in the sabji low salt also causes sickness high salt also causes sickness okay so high amounts of salt in our body can cause high blood pressure high blood pressure means bp na high bp if you eat more salt those eat na they will get the high bp high blood pressure if they feed the low salt we get a low blood pressure low bp so that is why we should add the right quantity of salt in the in the cooking do you know that many packaged food such as chips and namkin have very high amounts of salt and are therefore harmful so that is a why should why do we say to not to use the chips like kurkure lays all these chips because that chips have a high amount of salt so that we if you eat continuously those chips it affects our health in the small age itself we get the high bp okay it affects our health it is not good to eat the chips why they why they are adding the more salt means to keep it fresh not to spoil the chips and to, to make it more tasty okay but it is not good for the health okay so the uses of the common salt common salt means what sodium chloride okay that we use for the cooking in our house so common salt is used as a preservative preservative means saving for example if you prepare the achar pickles if you want to keep for so many days they keep salt more salt to, so that it will not be spoiled so preservative that means saving as a saving product and prevents means stops food from the spoiling to stop to stop food from the spoiling if you add the salt it will be saved by stopping the growth of bacteria so bacteria will not grow very fast next one common salt has an important raw material in production of many substances such as sodium hydroxide baking soda washing soda bleaching powder etc okay so through the common salt with the help of the sodium chloride only so many salts are prepared what are those salts sodium hydroxide naoh baking soda nahco3 you see nacl the common salt okay now sodium hydroxide means what naoh base na baking soda uh, nahco3 then washing soda nacco3 in everything na is there na yes so that is why it is they all this prepared from the uh, salt then oral rehydration ors ors means what oral rehydration solution hydration means what water okay rehydration means get through get the enough amount of water in the body rehydration solution okay so sometimes when we get the continuous diarrhea continuous motions when we have the sickness as continuous vomiting what we do means so when we have the continuous vomiting it affects we lose the water in the body hydration water hydra hydrogen okay water so to again to remove that re, that dryness in the body we get the ors that is rehydration to remove the uh, sorry to give to remove that dryness in the body we take ors okay so which is solution of sugar and salt in the water in the primary is the primary treatment when our body get dehydrated 
when we lose the more water in the body otherwise when the continuous diarrhea vomiting is there so ors is the first aid first treatment so we can take the salt water with little salt sugar and water mixing if you take means we regain the energy okay so some questions are there uh, we have two water samples a and b sodium hydrogen carbonate and and found in sample a and magnesium sulfate as found in sample b which sample of water is hard and why okay so sample a in the sample a we have the hydrogen carbonate salt in the sample b we have the magnesium sulfate which water is hard magnesium sulfate is hard okay because magnesium sulfate after boiling also the salts cannot be separated but sodium hydrogen carbonate after boiling the water we can separate that salt but magnesium sulfate cannot separate that is why it has the permanent hardness it is more hard okay and give two natural sources of common salt that means from the sodium chloride what are the salts we get baking soda and washing soda sodium hydrogen carbonate and sodium carbonate write the answers here like this small questions you will get in the exam from in between the chapters okay salmon what is that nahco3 means sodium hydrogen carbonate so this salt also prepared from the common salt another one nacio3 sodium carbonate